In reinforcement learning, the agent inputs actions into the environment and returns rewards and states as outputs. The agent then looks at the value of the reward that comes back and changes its policy about its own behavior. The key here is that for each state, there is an action policy that maximizes the reward expected value. Reinforcement learning is a method of optimization. Reinforcement learning is an optimization technique. And when we say optimization, there must be some value that can be maximized or minimized in this case. The value that can be maximized is the value that can be minimized. In this case, the value that can be maximized is the expected value of the reward. The equation for this is shown in the upper right corner. The white argument of the conditional probability P is S. A. Ah, which means that the agent will take action A in state S. The left side of the argument of P is states S and R which are outputs from the environment. This is called a Merkov decision process. And the two equations below show this as divided by state transitions and rewards. Consider this with the example of a maze, grid of nine squares. The agent starts in the upper left square and the goal is the lower right square. According to the Merkov decision process, for each of the states S1 to S9, there is an action strategy policy that maximizes the reward. The expected value of the reward for each state is the sum of the probability of the state transition destination and it can be expressed as the sum of the immediate and discounted rewards. By defining it in this way, through repeated trial and error, it can be expressed as with the value of immediate reward or 1, which can be obtained at the goal, while being discounted, gradually propagating to the starting point.